Welcome back to GitHub Awesome, the place where discover the hottest open source projects every week. This is GitHub Trending Weekly number 11, and today we're diving into 25 open source projects on GitHub. Whether you're building tools, exploring AI, or just hunting for inspiration, this week's lineup has something you'll definitely want to star or fork. GitLog. It turns your Git history into a cinematic animated replay right inside your terminal. Instead of scrolling through raw commits, GitLog lets you watch your project evolve with realistic typing animations and file changes, almost like your code base is telling its own story. It supports tree sitter syntax highlighting across 26 languages, shows a live project file tree with change stats, and even includes a screensaver mode that plays random commits endlessly. Depth Anything 3 a model that aims to recover the entire visual space from any view. You don't need fancy multi-branch architectures. A single plane transformer backbone and a unified depth ray representation are enough to solve a huge range of geometry tasks. One model can handle monocular depth, multi-view depth fusion, pose condition depth, and even 3D Gaussian prediction for high fidelity novel view synthesis. Windows Edge Lite a lightweight WPF app that adds a sleek, customizable glowing edge light around your primary monitor. If you want subtle ambient lighting for video calls, streaming, or just to make your workspace look more professional, this is a tiny tool that punches way above its weight. There's a soft white gradient and blur for a natural glow, adjustable opacity from 20% to 100%, and an automatic update system. Cloudflare Proxy Manager, a CLI tool for anyone managing domains on Cloudflare. Instead of logging into the Cloudflare dashboard every time you want to toggle that famous orange cloud, this tool lets you enable or disable Cloudflare proxying directly from your terminal. You can list all your Cloudflare zones, browse every DNS record with clear visual indicators, and even bulk select multiple records to switch their proxy status at once. LPLB, the linear programming-based load balancer designed specifically for mixture of experts models. This project takes expert parallelism to the next level by using linear programming to optimize how workloads are distributed across MOE experts. Instead of static routing, LPLB dynamically reorders experts based on real-time workload stats and then solves for the optimal token assignment for every batch. EverMemOS, an enterprise-grade intelligent memory system that wants your AI to do more than remember, it wants it to understand. EverMemOS turns conversation history into structured, actionable memories. Instead of a flat log, it distills atomic mem cells, builds multi-level episodes and profiles, and indexes them for lightning-fast retrieval, so agents can recall not just facts, but the meaning behind them. FastGS, a project that training 3D Gaussian splatting in 100 seconds. FastGS works seamlessly with existing backbones like vanilla 3DGS and MIP splatting, meaning you can drop it into your workflow without major refactoring. It's also fully multitask ready. Dynamic scenes, large scale scenes, FastGS handles them all. And thanks to its memory efficient design, it runs comfortably even on more modest hardware. Here's a delightful little demo, ASCII Cube, a real-time 3D ray-marched cube rendered entirely as Unicode art in your terminal. It's tiny but polished. Watch rain, jagged mountains, and a sun light source animate while the cube follows a smooth motion path and keep an eye on the FPS volume HUD in the corner. There's even a compact chiptune-style music loop to set the mood. Supertonic, a fast text-to-speech system built for total privacy. Running on ONNX runtime, Supertonic requires no cloud services, no API calls, and no internet. It can generate speech up to, up to 167 times faster than real-time on consumer hardware like the M4 Pro. Despite being ultra-light at just 66 million parameters, it handles natural text effortlessly. Numbers, dates, currency, abbreviations, complex expressions. Remote Jump Tool, a piece exec style remote service manager built on top of Impacket. This tool is designed for legitimate enterprise security workflows, especially for researchers who need to test lateral movement detection, service deployment visibility, and operational tradecraft in a controlled environment. Remote Jump Tool lets you upload your own custom service loader, giving you full control over what gets executed during testing scenarios. 
Up next is Stax, a containerized download manager built specifically for Anna's archive. Stax gives you a clean, password-protected web interface to queue, manage, and automatically download books, all with minimal manual effort. It integrates with Anna's archive fast download API and even falls back to mirrors if a fast download isn't available, so your downloads stay reliable no matter what. Continuous Claude, a CLI tool that turns Claude code into a fully autonomous continuous AI coding loop. Instead of the usual one-shot AI coding tools that stop after completing a task, Continuous Claude keeps going, autonomously creating pull requests, waiting for CI checks, and then maintaining persistent context across iterations. This means it can tackle multi-step projects and make progressive improvements, all while you sleep. Carpathy, an agentic machine learning engineer built to train ML models autonomously. Using the Claude Code SDK and Google ADK, Carpathy showcases how Claude's scientific reasoning and coding capabilities can be applied directly to machine learning workflows. It's a simple implementation. From designing experiments to executing model training, Carpathy can handle tasks that typically require a human ML engineer. Ephemera Book Downloader, the automated tool for grabbing books from your favorite online archives. Ephemera can search, download, and organize books completely on its own, supporting everything from EPUB and PDF to Mobi and more. If a book isn't available yet, no problem. The built-in request system keeps watching for it and automatically downloads it the moment it appears, with support for donor keys, Cloudflare bypassing, and a dead simple Docker setup. Next, AIDraw.io, a Next.js web app that brings AI directly into your diagramming workflow. With LLM-powered commands, you can create, modify, and enhance Draw.io diagrams just by talking to the AI, no manual dragging required. You can even upload existing images or diagrams, and the AI will automatically replicate and improve them. The interactive chat interface lets you refine your diagrams in real time, while animated connectors add dynamic visuals for better clarity. Cloudflare Error Page Generator. This little tool lets you create customized error pages that mimic Cloudflare's famous oops style, perfect for pranks or just adding some humor to your site. You can even embed these pages directly into your own website, giving you full control over the look and message. It's simple and perfect for developers who want to mess around with web humor or create playful placeholders for error scenarios. Bishan, a minimal email archiver written in Rust, complete with a built-in web UI. Bishan runs as a single binary with no external dependencies, making it lightweight yet powerful. It can handle multiple email accounts, supports IMAP and OAuth2 authentication, and even works through network proxies. You can select which emails to archive by date, mailbox, or number of messages, and the system automatically discovers and configures your IMAP server. ReclaimR, a Python CLI tool designed to automatically manage disk space for your Jellyfin media stack. ReclaimR analyzes your watch history, media age, and usage patterns to determine which files can be safely deleted, helping you maintain a healthy disk usage without losing content that matters. It integrates with multiple APIs, Jellyfin, Jellystat, and Sonar, giving it a complete view of your media library. Prism a personal website template built with Next.js. Prism is perfect for researchers and academics who want to showcase their portfolio, publications, and projects with minimal hassle. Everything is configuration-driven. Just update TomL, Markdown in the content directory, and your site updates automatically. No coding required. The design is sleek and modern, with responsive layout and dark mode. Ringlight, a lightweight macOS menu bar utility that adds a customizable ring light overlay to your screen. This app lets you display an adjustable circular ring, perfect as a visual indicator, a subtle ring light effect for streaming, or even just a fun visual cue on your desktop. Ring light sits neatly in the menu bar and gives you intuitive controls to adjust the ring's position, size, and appearance in real time. Cotile turns a single numerical code into a unique visual style for image generation. Instead of relying on long textual prompts, reference images, or complex fine-tuning, Cotile introduces code-to-style image generation. Each numeric code maps to a distinct style, 
which conditions a text-to-image diffusion model to produce consistent, reproducible, and novel visual styles. UVI Trends, a personalized news aggregator designed to keep you ahead of the curve in AI and machine learning. This tool fetches, ranks, and presents the latest trending content from the AI ML ecosystem, from GitHub trending repos and hugging face papers, Apple Newsroom-inspired card layout. Each item can include a one-sentence summary and a trending explanation generated by Cohere or Anthropic Claude. Nora 1.5, a VLA model designed for real-world decision-making and robotic control. Building on the Nora Foundation, this model improves instruction following, planning, and closed-loop control by leveraging world model-based and action-based preference rewards. That means it can learn from expert preferences and simulated environments to make better, more consistent decisions in complex tasks. PoolViz, a memory pool visualizer built with React and originally designed as a debugging tool for exploit developers. PoolViz gives you an interactive look at how memory chunks are distributed across different layers of the Windows segment heap, capable of rendering millions of chunks in just a few hundred milliseconds, thanks to clever optimizations like binary search for visible blocks, run length encoded rectangle merging, and a dynamic level of detail system. Tidescope, a tool designed to simplify open source collaboration. Inspired by star maps, Tidescope scans GitHub repositories for issues, PRs, and to-do comments, then uses LLM-powered analysis to extract required skills, difficulty, and priority. The result? A technical debt star map, where each task is a star, distributed from center to edge by importance, with related PR issue pairs forming constellation-like clusters. 